Hey guys, Good Justice here. Now, remember when I said in my last video that I was going to um, rewrite uh, Advanced Minecraft? Well, while while I was doing that, I I came up with an idea to do add a thirst bar, which you could see. Um, so this is a totally different command, not Advanced Minecraft. So, um, yeah, but it'll have something to do with it in the future. Because I'm going to make the custom command mod pack. My, I'm going to make my own. So, um, I'm calling this the water update because it doesn't only add a thirst bar. It adds something to do with squids, a new boss, of course. And I don't know why I have a bow. And it adds a rune. Which I ran out of armor to use, so I'm starting to. So I made my own type of like equipment, and then I made a texture pack for this slot, which will be in the description below. So yeah, so thirst bar. So thirst bar. Let me just go into survival so that it works. So it. See, look, it depletes, like, here, if I do, players set, if I set it to 10, I'll start to get some effects that I don't like. And then if I set it to 5, It kind of gets a little bit worse. And then when it goes to zero, that's when you're in trouble. So, a way to prevent this is to like, drink some milk, which heals 25. Or drink some water, which heals 20. Um, uh, and another way is to eat like stew or something. Rabbit stew heals 13. I think this heals a little bit more. Beetroot soup heals a little bit more. Or just eat a melon. Like a watermelon. And that will heal 10. Or, there's another way you can do this. You can jump into water, and it'll fill up your thirst bar. Yeah, and there is a way to prevent the thirst bar, bar from going down. And that's what the Rune of Waves does. It prevents thirst and allows you to breathe underwater. Now, to, I'm going to show you how you get this rune, so... Um, you're gonna have to fight a boss to get it, but... quickly kill the squid. Um, just had to kill the squid real quick. Um, because I don't want to give away anything. So, um, yeah. So what you need is a beacon. I'm just gonna put it down here. And a sea lantern. And some lapis. So, what you want to do is drop the lapis on the sea lantern, and it'll spawn the Rune of Waves boss. And you have to fight him. And he also does that, so. He spawns guardians. And stuff, so. I, I don't have any armor, which was probably a big mistake on my part. Honestly. So, let me go into creative. And kill him real quick. He has 150 health, but I made him annoying, so. And plus, this. And plus, it makes really glitched water like that. It's awesome. 
Come on. Just die already! All these guardians get in my way. Must be the diamond armor. Oh, there we go. So yeah, he drops the rune of waves. And let me just kill all these guardians. Real quick. Um, there we go. Now I'll kill all the items. Wait. So, yeah, there we go. The squids are spawning! Um, so, yeah. Uh, if I go back into survival, see my thirst bar is still going down. That's because I don't have it equipped in the right spot. So, if I just take one of these and put it right there, you can see I have this I have this particle effect. Kind of looks cool when I run with it. Gotta go fast. Um. So, yeah, I get the particle effect. I get third. My thirst automatically gets filled, and I also get water breathing. So, yeah, if I just jump into this pool of water won't lose any breath so yeah and then next we have the thing with the squids so like if you get within five blocks of them they'll try to run away like in the positive x and z direction where if you want to kill them the trick is to get them stuck there because they can't go any other direction when they're running because they're stupid and then if you get to, if you get within two blocks of them, you'll get uh, blindness, which will be really annoying if you want insects for some reason. Yeah, and then, yeah, it lasts for 10 seconds, so you might want to snipe them or something. Yeah, but the cool thing about these water things is you can, like, jump on them and do a this oh no um yeah and i also i also kind of like how the rune of waves will like i like how the runes they cover up like the diamond thing so it looks like they're actually on the string but yeah this will be a challenge for your world and it's raining great And plus, um, it doesn't it doesn't only just work with water bottles. Um, potions will also um, quench quench your thirst. And yeah, I think it's a pretty cool, pretty cool and unique um, mechanic. I mean, probably other people have done it, but I don't know. But I am. In my new commands, I am going to add more runes. So, um, you might want to keep this texture pack on when you're doing that. And then in the custom command mod pack, which I'll be doing once I, uh, get a few, rewrite those commands and get a few more done, you know, there will be oh, some things you have to do with the runes and also, um, the relics. Like, um, the overlord helmet, uh, the shadow boots, and um, yeah, the, the white hot chest plate and hook neck leggings. Oh, I made a lot of them. I'm just I'm just gonna say the armor. And then um, yeah, and then there's gonna be more runes too, which you're gonna have to like combine at one point to uh, get like an amulet. Um. You'll have to get an amulet that will give you power. So yeah, and then th and then there's gonna be other stuff too, like hard mode and well, not like hard mode, not not like I don't mean hard mode like that. I mean hard mode. 
kind of like Terraria, but different. There's going to be different mobs. So yeah, I have spoiled enough for you. Um, that was the water update command. The downloads going to be in the description below as well as the resource pack. And I'll see you all later.